Hello everybody and welcome back to the lovely time of the day where I like to put myself in the rigors of the gungeon for your enjoyment. I Silent G plays the gungeon. So uh, today we are going to play a run as the hunter. Last time we found this guy again. Goodbye. Oh! 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 <laughs> I got wrecked! Ha! <laughs> and I locked the helmet. <laughs> okay, that was funny. Oh, what's this? A statue in memory of a great bullet. The primer, the gunpowder, something, and the casing. Okay, so I got to the fifth floor, so I've unlocked that to show me that those are the things I need to win, because I talked to the um, person again. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Right, so what's in here? Plus one bullets, angry bullets, the Oregon, the heart purse, and fat bullets. Well, I didn't get angry bullets. Angry bullets sound cool. They sound angry. I was told recently that uh, the audio is a bit too high. Unfortunately, I can't actually turn it down any further. So, um, guess you'll have to deal. Mm. Oh, got my tea with me. Ready for some great dungeon play. Dungeon play? Dungeon? What's a dungeon? Ugh, some great gungeon play. Any more for any more? Yes. Right, so. Objectives this run is to honestly maybe get one of the parts to um the fifth floor boss and maybe beat the fifth floor boss. Oh dear. Let's just uh, clear out that room nice and fast. More enemies. Grenades. Oh. That actually was really bad. But we cleared the room. No damage. It's all good. So uh, we're playing as the hunter this time. Oh, hello. Which um, starts with some specific benefits. Uh, she has the crossbow. Which is probably the... Um, it's a very good floor 1 to floor 2 item. But past that it becomes pretty useless. But she also has the dog, which is basically a really strong passive upgrade throughout the entire game because it just finds you more items. And finding more keys and not having to buy them could be really strong. So uh, switching to the um, pistol for the bat rooms because you don't want to waste a crossbow shot on the bullets. No. Aha! Key. That is good. We can now enter both our chest rooms on this floor if we want to. Because, uh... As you guys know, my opinion on brown tre- che- oh. Oh my word. <laughs> I thought that second shot would land. So I did not- Oh! Plan to dodge roll out of the way. Yes, our um- uh, My opinion of brown chest is very low. I don't think they're worth keys most of the time. They're just- The things you get out of them are usually very subpar. This room is not pleasant. These books. Oh, let's let's so now I have FPS issues again. Um, before last run, I had a run which unfortunately had to be um cancelled. Well, cancelled. I didn't. I ended up not recording it because FPS issues came about halfway through the run and wouldn't leave. I was playing at like 15 FPS and they, it just wouldn't stop. It was a, honestly a serious pain. But uh, we seem to be fine now. Oh, hello. Oh, there's that water barrel. If we want to go into the... Um, if we would like to enter the secret room. Which with two keys already and uh, our shop not yet found, we might want to do. That's... Uh, oh, that was stupid. I somehow thought there'd be a bit more of a delay. Obviously there wasn't. Oh, well, at least I got my health back. And there is our shop. Is there a key for sale? There is not. That is upsetting. Um, I guess we're going this way. So it looks like we'll be relying on the dog to hopefully get um, two more keys. Two more keys would be ideal, because four keys, secret room, and both chests. Oh, no. <laughs> but um, uh, honestly... I'm happy with only getting one key and opening a secret room and one non-brown chest. Wow. The barrel though. That's 
that room dealt with. Although we unfortunately took a damage, which was... Nope. <laughs> Not worth it, in my opinion. Brown chest for a key. Oh, hello. Poison vial, potion of gun friendship, and barrel. Potion of gun friendship sounds like it would be really useful. So I'll pick up that. Just have that vial. I believe the... I don't know where the fireplace room is. Was it this one? No, it's this one over there. So, and here's our blue chest. What is in here? Table tech rocket. End table. I've never seen this before. The engine technique causes tables to fire off like rockets when flipped. Okay. That's, that's hilarious. I'm a big fan of this item. Right, so going to the boss fight. Hopefully we get some keys from this. They're fighting the Bullet King. Oh no! And we're back. Right, okay. <laughs> that was a bit worrying. Oh. Come on. Nope. And flawless. Bullet King is probably one of my favourite enemies to fight. His tap patterns are relatively easy to figure out. So we've got the Mastery, the Charm, the Bow. Yeah, you can give me some money. We did not get a key, unfortunately, so... Uh, I may as well open the brown chest then, to get a different weapon. Because I'm not a big fan of the rusty side of it. Heart and the Mailbox Special Delivery. Uh, we may as well go back through the portal, not to waste time. Right, so a root clearer, I think we'll use the Charmed Bow, I guess? I remember we got this a few runs ago and it's pretty good. <sighs> Just uh, refueling the old uh, tea chamber. So, we are head onwards. Oh, remember to charge it before going into a room. And the fact that it doesn't kill those guys in one shot is pretty upsetting. If you could like kill your friend there, that would be great. <laughs> well, it's functionally useless, but it was funny. Ugh. Yeah, the Chant Bow is definitely not my favourite of the items. I'll go with the mailbox instead. I wonder what it does. It looks like it has a special. <coughs> <coughs> Pardon me. Oh, that was stupid. Wrong way. Yes, it looks like it has a special effect on the last shot. Yes, that one exploded. Okay, so that room cleared. Uh, I don't know how I feel about the mailbox. It seems okay. Especially when you get the explosive one. I can imagine that the poison one would be less. Yeah. Less of an instant gratification kind of thing. Kaboom. Ha! <laughs> well, that was a good shot. I'm not sure what those starry things do. Oh, a key. Thank you, uh, dog. It's very nice. Yeah, you, you, can, you can die in righteous fire. And you. I think that's just a higher damage shot with maybe a small AoE? I'm not sure. Right, so I continue heading upwards. Uh, keys are looking okay for this floor because we found one from the uh, dog. Do not, not a fan of this room at all. Right, oh, wasted that. Uh. 
Hey, well, the explosive shot definitely came in handy there. We have our shop up here. What have we got in here? The Prime Primer, the Alien Sidearm, the Key, Ammo, and a Thin. We've also got a Great. So I will definitely be dropping this garbage. I just oh wow, thirty. Okay, that was wor that was worth a lot. Um, yeah, the Chant Bow is definitely not a weapon I enjoy. So I just thought I'd use my um active item because why not? Otherwise, it's just going to be wasted. May as well use it to clear rooms. Oh, I missed that. That was bad. Did I get him? Yeah, I got him. The Ammo Mantle, or whatever he's called. I could definitely use a, um... Oh! I could definitely use with some sort of accuracy upgrade for the mailbox. Definitely not how well accurate I'd like it to be. I should deal with him. And then this should deal with him. There you go. Room cleared? Yes. Oh. Ah. Itchy here. Ignore me. <laughs> Speak stupid. Right, uh, hopefully we've got a chest room coming up. Not the chest room I was looking for. We will find a different chest room. Oh! No! Oh, come on! Definitely not a fan of bullet bum cube rooms. Well, here's our boss. I think we have enough ammo to be able to realistically take that down. So hopefully we'll find a different weapon in our second chest room. Well, please. That's that room cleared. Definitely not much ammo left in the mailbox now. I think I'll use my um. Ah. ah, I got stuck in the wall. That's really irritating. Oh, uh, we're not dead yet, but we're getting close. The weapons we've got have not been ideal. Another blobulon, which is uh, good in some ways. Let's get rid of the enemies that are going to cause us real trouble. Oh, that's not good. Ah, it was either dodge the um, bullet or dodge the blobulon. I chose wrong. And you're down here, yes? Oh, not a good time to reload, but okay. Right, room cleared. Okay, here's our chest room. Hopefully it can need something very good. Green chest. Aha! The demon head. Uh, I will definitely take that. And we've got this room. Which always seems to appear on the second floor, I've noticed now. Right, so we're going to be using the demon head. Uh, I think we'll... I don't think we can get ammo. Right, let's just let's just try and clear the boss. Like, hopefully. <laughs> uh, hopefully... Oh, the beholster. Not the enemy I was hoping for. It's doable, though. Kill the eye thing. Kill the rockets. Laser beam. The burn is definitely doing work on him. Come on. Got him. Another flawless, nice. Demon head definitely came in handy there. Uh, no, you can you can go right away. Two keys, mastery, the flame hands, and some armor. So with a two keys, I will go open this brown chest, even if it's just I get something to sell, which uh, might end up being the case. 
Oh, table tech sight. Okay, no, a second table tech's great. Um, right. So I've got the demon head, flame hands, crossbow. I don't think I need the mailbox anymore. No! I press G instead of F. I regret everything. Ah! Damn it! Right. Well, we'll pick up the Prime Primer. I can't remember what this does. I know it doesn't say it does anything. But I, I, I'm sure it does something. I read it did something somewhere. Right, let's pick up crossbow, crossbow ammo. So now we have the flame hand, the crossbow for normal rooms, the flame hands for difficult rooms, and hopefully we'll find some ammo for the demon head for the next boss. We're not doing too bad. That second flawless definitely helped. But it's not without a doubt that we are going to need to find some big health if we want to keep going right here, right here. Right, crossbow. So gonna start taking two shots to kill things. I can't believe I accidentally sold sold the potion of gun friendship. But that's not just a small mistake. The potion of gun friendship is easily like a get this to the final boss and your run is much more likely to succeed. Please die. Thank you. I, I just got an achievement. I have no idea what for though. Please die. I feel, I feel like maybe I shouldn't be using my crossbow for <laughs> the tiny bobulons. Right, next room. Oh, I hate this guy. And this guy. And these guys. Hunt complete. Aha! I was not aware there was a flaming guy. Ah, there's not any more. Some health, that's good. Although we're still not anywhere near full. Good rolls, good rolls. I need to take down the skull. Yeah, if I could get a hit, that would be great. Definitely not per perfect accuracy on these shots. It'd be nice if I did have it. I love um. I think it's called muscle relaxant. Uh, cre uh, greatly increases accuracy. And that's that guy dealt with. Found a shot. Uh, which is kind of useless unless we find something like a... Oh, there's the blast helmet. Um, I'm assuming that'll just be like immunity to explosions or something. I mean, it might be something really cool like... It explodes when hit. Which could definitely provide some real tangible benefit. But for 49, it could also just be like not knocked back. Although there are boots that do that. So it's probably not that exact thing. These guys could like be hit ever. Woo! Okay. We're doing fine. We have a key. Right. That's one down. Go up. Take this guy out. Ah! I didn't mean to hit the blob. Ah, I'm an empty. Okay, okay, so I have cross ammo, but we have the flame hand. I'm hoping the bird will kill them. Well, almost, I guess. We have a key NPC room! I'm an idiot. I thought I was about to walk off the other side, so I rolled. 
And obviously I didn't roll anywhere near far enough. Ah, oh, that was really upsetting. Right. I, I saw it open its mouth. Please die. Please. 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 Shoot anything. Let's stick with the flame hands for now. At least we've got the health back that we lost in that room. And a blank. Any more enemies? No, thankfully. We're definitely pretty low right now, so I'm definitely hoping for maybe a full heal room. That would be nice. The doctor room. Oh my god. There's a charge up high damage shotgun, it appears. That uh, seems okay. I think we're going to have to go, because if this is a full heal room, it could save our entire run. So I think we have to spend our key here. Oh no, it's map guy. Yes, I will explore the floor for you, because maybe you might drop a heart, in which case I will be eternally grateful. I don't believe our shop had a heart. That was far too close. Okay, so it does definitely does high damage, which is nice. You just have to get close enough for all of them to hit. Okay, so these guys move back to the position they were intended to be in. That's interesting. No. <laughs> Playing really cautious right now. Don't want to take that damage, especially when there's a definite chance that we can get some more health from the dog or the secret room. Secret room? Uh, NPC room. Link. Zelda. Um, no, Link. It is Link. <laughs> right. Continue on. Nope. Okay, I stopped them being buffed. Killed that guy. No more enemies. Okay, that's good. <laughs> We're making it. Step by step. Stay away from me, please. No! I couldn't dodge roll in time. Well, it's a third floor run. It wasn't too bad. 21 minutes. Mm, I think that'll be enough for this episode. But uh, there will be a second episode coming shortly after this one. I'll see you guys next time. My name is Sonic G, and I'm exiting the dungeon.